Hey, my people, my people, how are you today? Good morning, guys. A blessed new week to every one of us. What a privilege it is to see this day. Yes, so, so, guys, how is your Sunday going? If you're cooking that rice, whether or not jello rice, whether or not rice and stew, or rich, rich, rich rice, whichever one you are cooking, remember, say, Mama Juliana, I day here. So, when you day eat, I beg, remember for me, I'm on my way to come eat it. So, guys, last week, a lot of events did take place, okay? So we're coming about the school where can collapse for just yes, and we heard what happened to those children. Some of them we're not they fortunate, we heard what happened, and then for Abuja again, they talk say another two story building which is flat. Uh huh, that one can't fall again, and people come there inside of it. Yes, I don't know not right now whether they were able to get them out or whether they get any casualties, not extremely sure right now. But guys, think about this. The people that this thing affected, is it because they are worse than us? Is it because they did anything more terrible than we did? No. The Bible specifically talks about Job. Remember, Job never did anything wrong, but temptations came to him. So temptations are bound to happen. But the God of heaven has actually exempted you and I from such stories. So guys, no matter what happens, as long as we are on the surface of this earth, no matter what is going on, food scarcity, poverty, whatever the case may be, we have to be grateful. So this week, we are grateful to the one that made the heavens and the earth. The one that says, Isaiah 41, 10, that he will uphold us with his right hand of mercy. And God is actually doing that for you. And I, he says, do not fear, for I am with you. Isaiah 41, 10. He says, do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will uphold you with my right hand of mercy. And he is doing that because he is God all by himself. Himself. I remember forever his word is settled in the heavens above. So hang in there, child of God. No matter what is going on, no matter what life throws at you in this week, I am praying for you that the one that says that he is with you will continue to be with you. He will give you ways. He will give you ideas. Yes, ideas to navigate this whole week. You will come out a blessed person in this week just like the stars of the skies cannot be counted child of god in this season the blessings of jehovah upon your life can never be counted just as the skies are so beautiful to behold child of god your life my god will make pretty yes and beautiful in this new week in the matchless name of yeshua i have prayed and so shall it be so whatever your heart desires Hold on to that one that says, do not be dismayed, do not be frightened, do not be shaken, because him that is God is with you today, tomorrow, and forever. So a blessed and a happy new week to every one of us. May his protection be upon you. Psalm 91 verse 1, he says it, that his shadow will forever be your portion, that you will dwell under that shadow, because that shadow is a shadow of protection, provision, promotion, and so shall it be for you and I, in the matchless name of Jesus. Amen. My name remains Juliana. Love God, serve God, bless humanity. In all your gettings, get understanding. Make sure you make somebody smile this week. With the little that you have, a cup of water does go a long way. All right. I love, love, love you guys. God bless you guys. Thank you for your endless support. For everybody that has been there for us, God bless you and reward you accordingly. Yes, our purpose on earth is to help as many as we can afford to do and that is the mission we are working on and we will keep doing it till thy kingdom come all right so join me on this mission and let's go on this journey god bless you guys and i will always love you see you later have a beautiful one everyone bye bye peace